Welcome back. Business sentiment among Japan's large manufacturers remain cautious about the economy's trajectory due to lingering concerns on the coronavirus and its variants. Dennis Liu reports. Japan's major manufacturers remain cautious about the economy's trajectory with business sentiment flat for the quarter as concerns about the pandemic linger. A key survey showed Monday. Among major non-manufacturers, however, there was an improvement in confidence about the world's third largest economy, offering glimmers of hope. The Bank of Japan's Tankan Business Survey, a quarterly poll of about 10,000 companies, showed a reading of plus 18 for major manufacturers, unchanged from the previous quarter and slightly lower than market consensus of plus 19. Among large non-manufacturers, meanwhile, confidence improved to plus 9 from plus 2 in the previous quarter, the sixth consecutive improvement. The short-term business sentiment survey reports the difference between the percentage of firms that are upbeat and those that see conditions as unfavorable. A positive figure means more companies see business conditions as favorable than those that consider them unfavorable. It is considered to be the broadest indicator of how Japan Incorporated is faring. The latest reading comes with concerns over the Omicron variant of the coronavirus. Japan has seen a smaller virus outbreak than many countries, with fewer than 18,400 deaths despite avoiding harsh lockdowns. Emergency virus measures that largely affected bars and restaurants, as well as limiting large events, were in place in parts of the country for much of the year, but were lifted finally in October. To address concerns over the Omicron variant, Japan earlier this month abruptly asked airlines to stop taking all new incoming flight reservations for a month but later softened the blanket ban to make it easier for citizens to return. Its vaccination program, which began later than in many developed countries and started slowly, has picked up speed, however, with around 78% of the population now fully inoculated. And the government this month started administering the third dose of vaccine, initially targeting health workers. The government has also pledged large stimulus measures in a bid to support economic recovery. This is the latest for now. Reporting from Tokyo, Japan, this is Dennis Liu. We live in interesting times.